All right. Ah, here we go. All right, it looks like my audio was working. If it's too loud, let me know and I'll lower the gain. Um, okay, seems to pick up the right amount. All right, well, I'm back, you guys. I have a new laptop, so more high-quality streams. Okay, this chair is one squeaky boy. Uh, yeah, so webcam, the integrated webcam is a lot better, and... Um, yeah, this thing is the Acer Nitro 5 with, let's see, 8 gigabytes of DDR4 RAM and a GeForce GTX 1050. That's 2 old gigs of VRAM. And I believe this has a 1 terabyte mechanical hard drive with some upgradability space. That's cool. And I figured it was on sale so I can make some much needed investments. So I invested in a Logitech G602 really good mouse I'm in love with this ever since day one especially because of the um, thumb rest up here it's so comfortable and then I also bought myself some Razer Krakens so that's really nice alright uh, I just gotta look at some audio settings so if I turn this off hear myself here I want to make it so that I can't hear myself but I can also hear the game audio I'm trying to remember which ones to disable all right I think I got it okay so I just got to disable a1 and that should be fine all right so aside from that new overlay uh, I have my webcam down in the bottom left corner of the stream, and I've got my affiliate logos. These are the companies that have endorsed me. Well, okay, not exactly endorsed me. I'm the one endorsing them. So, all the guys above, check those guys out. They are great people, and I've got affiliate links in the description if you want some deals off of some awesome things. Uh, one of the ones that is not listed uh, in the logo slideshow up here is Green Man Gaming. I also have um, an affiliate link for them, which gives you 10% off your game purchase, which is great because they already have cheaper games. Uh, they have games for a lot cheaper, so you're getting even more of a discount than you originally were. So that's amazing. And then over here you'll see that there's a new follow thing. This thing right over here. Um, yeah, that's just part of my Streamlabs thing. So that's pretty cool. So if you follow or if you host, then you'll show up right there. Uh, if that's too small to read, let me know. Yeah, now I'm working on a native resolution of 1920 by 1080 and it's amazing. So good. Anyway, so for today, I'm going to play some Future Fall Retro. Uh, let's see, is the music on? I don't know if the music is on. I don't know what I can hear or what I can't hear. It's hard to tell what I'm hearing. I still need to buy um, an HDMI to VGA converter for my new uh, monitor. It's an old monitor. It's just a hand-me-down from somebody that I know. Yeah. Oh, yeah. The best part about these Razer Krakens. Microphone slides out. I love this thing so much. And they're extremely comfortable. Only Razer could uh, hit me up with a sponsorship, you know. I've got an email on my YouTube channel. Okay, for some reason this game does not feel like loading today. Uh, let's try that again.
So, here we go. So, that's my entire character. I've been, uh, working with some outfits. I've got most of the Alpha Black Light outfit going on, except I decided to combine it with some higher level, well, higher armor level items, so that's a lot tougher, but it looks like the low level gear that it's based off of. Although I still need the pants. I need to find the pants for those. There we go. So we're gonna go to settings. Um, master volume. There we go. Now we got some music going on. So if you guys wanna join me, feel free. I'll be around. So, I was told that Genius Grove is the best place to grind. Um, because the enemies over there give more Taros. But, we're gonna go to Goat's hey, Junkyard, simply because... Well, they give you almost as much Taros, and also they give better gear. I gotta complete this outfit. But, uh, yeah, some new stuff. The Spider Monkey Arms. I just randomly got those somehow. Uh, I've also got my long cloak, which is up for grabs if you want a rare trade. And then action blindfold, I will only trade this for another ultra rare. Uh, I'm looking for a bandana, but feel free to send me any other offers. Yeah. So a lot of people are asking, what's the progress with the past? Well, I'm not on the dev team. I do talk to them sometimes. They're really nice people. Uh, I think... Um, uh, what did Devin say? Uh, one, of the, one of the guys behind the game, Devin, said something about they need to work on enemy placement that's like the biggest problem and also the fight with Lord Fuse the final boss is also a bit of trouble to develop so they gotta work on that but otherwise the past is pretty close to done they estimate a couple months at the very latest which is actually really good considering how long the future took the future was supposed to come out December of 2016, and then we got the tutorial last August. Alright, so we got our toxic spawns. The toxic. So, for corruption attacks, the nano element based attacks, this is a Cosmix. Fell out of last stance. The only one you have is Buttercup at this moment, so bring that one with you. And uh, you're noticing that I have group heal on Buttercup instead of keeping the stun. I forget why I did that. Because <laughs> I already have two other healing nanos. But I guess it's nice to have like two healers. One extra. Like I'm considering changing number twos. But he's a run. And Eddie's run is just... I mean Jawbreaker Break, that's practically iconic in the Fusion Fall community. Why would you ever want to get rid of that? But, you know, you you do you guys. I have about 9,000 Taros. Hopefully I get a lot more. Maybe I can actually buy some of the rare stuff that people are selling, because one big item that's so on sale so far, the 2010 hat from the Time Squad, that costs like 50k to buy from other players. That is way too much money. So you'll see, we get 33 Taros per kill, which is nice. So we're going to be collecting these crates. Um, no. I need the Alpha Black Light Pants. Really want to complete the Alpha. Yeah, actually, Spider Monkey Arms, I kind of want to wear a uh, not a Coke. A cloak instead. Does that look cooler? Because I think it does. 
really shows my uh, emo character off, you know. You can tell he's going through an emo. guys. That's gonna be my senior quote. I hope that the pass comes out soon. Because I know that uh, that the person behind the coding is hard at work. Low Mayhem, for those that don't know him. He's awesome. He's basically Jesus. And then Percy is like the messiah. I'm gonna make like a few new followers. No way! Gotta go! What else have I received? Ooh, ooh, a super crate. And it's crappy pants. But a super duper crate is that is this. That. I think somebody actually wanted the Proton Meta Base last time. And I traded it to them. So if you wanted one of these, go for it. It's a rare item. I just wish I could trade the spider monkey arms, because, like, they're okay, but they're not my favorite item. And then I don't even have my clown mask for, uh, for some reason. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna wear that blindfold. And the problem with the blindfold is that it clips through my character's hair. So if the developers could maybe, like, I don't know, if you have control over how models overlap, that'd be cool if you could fix that. I mean, it doesn't matter to me. It's a tiny issue. I don't know, maybe you could put that in your next content update. Yeah. Oh yeah, so for those keeping up with a YouTube channel, you guys know that I want to make a series about MMOs that kind of made up my early days as a gamer. That's still in the works, it's just mostly in the planning stages because I don't know how I want to format this video. I don't know what I want to cover, I don't know where to get game like clips, I don't know where to get gameplay clips, because pretty much nobody made YouTube videos about this game in 2009. So I'm kind of at a loss for uh, sources for gameplay coverage. I could use retro footage, but I don't know, something about that just seems seems like I'm limited into what I can show if I were to use retro footage. In the original game's case, they could have videos from anywhere in the entire game. Instead, this is just the future. So it's either limited content but easy to capture, or hard to, hard to find content but it makes it more authentic. Let's see, let's see, is anybody in my chat? Hey, people are in my chat. Hello, my fellow lurkers. I've learned over time to not shout out people that are just lurking because they just want to not be noticed. So, I'm not going to shout you guys out. Well, not by name. But if you're lurking, I'll be like, hey, how's it going? It's Chuggy Conroy. No, just kidding. It's not Chuggy Conroy. Haha, they fooled me. You know what? I just noticed I'm covering the chat box. Um, crap. I'm gonna move this right here. Does that look weird at all? I don't know. If you want me to move stuff around, let me know. I'd be willing to change up my overlay. It's not perfect. 
because it can be a little bit different for every game if I want it to, because I don't want my webcam to cover anything crucial, like the text box where it shows how many tarot's I have. By the way, we hit over 10,000 tarot's, woohoo! And let's see, how much is this crap worth? Oh, it's the wrong pants! Okay, this is probably one of the best weapons you can have in terms of a gun weapon. And this... Toasty shirt. I have two toasty shirts in case anybody wants them. I'll trade to you. And if you're worried because you're not the right level to wear them, honestly, just give this game like a half hour. You can get to level 4 in almost no time. It's so easy. I need to buy another webcam, because, like, this webcam that's integrated is nice, but, like, I kind of want a Logitech C920, because I heard those are pretty good. I also have to, I have to buy some more stuff for computers, because I entered a contest on EVGA's PAX West stream, and I won myself an i7-8700K, which is awesome, because it's an amazing CPU for gaming. But I don't have a computer to run it on, so I have to buy all the parts. Although I do have a storage drive lying around, so that's like minus 40 bucks. But I mean, the CPU is like $300. So it's either I sell it on eBay and get 300 bucks, or use it in a build and spend nearly a thousand. I mean, if you guys have suggestions for parts that would be nice to have, let me know. I'll take any and all advice. Okay, so we're gonna be grinding until my entire inventory is filled with crates. Like, let's look at how full my inventory is right now. Only a few of these. What are these? What are those? LOL. So we've got... Let's see, it's a 4x5. Five five. So we got 20 spaces out of... Five. So we have 30 more spaces to fill with crates. Oh boy. I mean, trust me, it goes by pretty fast if you're farming the, uh, the dinosaur ones. I forget what they're called. Or like tech records or something. What are those things called? Motor Raptors. Wow, I was way off. I like the way my character jumps. You don't need to pull your knees in that close to you. Another crate. The annoying things about toxic spawns, while they're nice to grind, they have the dizzying um, ability. So they can just make you dizzy so many times. Like right there. I'm surprised people are actually watching today because I think school starts for a majority of the United States by now. School started for me last Tuesday. Started pretty early. It's actually kind of funny. People complain about homework on the first day of school when they first get into high school. But I'm a senior, and I'm just now getting my first homework assignment. And of course it's pre-calculus, so that's wonderful.
I'm not getting as many crates as I thought I would. How full are we? Oh, wow. Okay. How are none of these the thing that I want? You can only get something so many times. All I want is a pair of pants. Is it really that hard? Yes. yes it is. now noticing that they don't mention that fusion matter is added to the fusion matter meter because I'm over leveled. I think by the time the past releases I'll be level 5. I have more than double, almost triple fusion matter for level 5. So I'm probably going to be like level 6 by the time I get into there. I am not a fan of this thing. This boomstick. Stop it. One boomy boy. Also, there's apparently a Nintendo Direct tomorrow. I don't know if you guys are excited about that, but I am. I heard that's gonna be all about Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. Could be wrong. But if it's anything like the E3 Direct from think this year it's gonna be all about it or at least it's gonna, a majority of it is gonna be about it because at E3 Nintendo kind of glossed over everything and then it's just like screw it 30 minutes of Smash Bros ultimate coverage everybody's gonna love it and they were right but still like somebody had to have had that idea Shoes. These are not slick skaters. Those are not slick boys. We need 20 more crates before we can sell everything. That's the best part about grinding. When you think you're grinding for taros and you're done, you notice that you have a full inventory of items. And you could just sell those to Eddie. Well, not Eddie, but if you go to the cul de sac where Eddie is, you can just sell them and get like a thousand more taros. It's so profitable. Well, mostly because it's free, still. And even like, if you're replacing a weapon with something you found while grinding, your weapon is still worth taros because you technically got your weapon for free. Unless if you bought your weapon, and in that case, what's wrong with you? Like, there's no need to buy a weapon. Unless if you wanted to like, blend items so that you know, one item looks like something. No, so that a low, a high-powered item looks like a low-powered item that happens to look cooler, if that makes sense. By the way, with the follower notification, I forgot to mention this, uh, because of Streamlabs, I was able to use my own custom GIF. Well, okay, it's not mine. Uh, I found a funny GIF on the web. So if somebody follows or hosts, then, um, <laughs> you're in for something special. Although, don't follow and unfollow just so that you can see the thing. Only follow if you really want to follow my channel. Which I highly recommend you do. 
okay, someone else had the same idea. Who is this? The Saturn Princess. Now, I'm gonna help this guy out. You're welcome, Saturn. Uh, Toxic Spawns. I wish I could make reactions to the Nintendo Directs, but my last one got three copyright cards on it. Even though I made it perfectly clear that like if they have a problem with me using copyright material to email me at a specific email, they didn't even get a message about it. I mean, I know that they probably don't have the time to address that, but still, like, it's the thought that counts. Okay, let's see, how's our inventory doing? Okay, we need a few more crates, and we're ready to sell. Ooh, we got some gumballs. All the way up there. I don't know why I'm talking like this. So we need 16 more crates. See, we're already halfway there. Lemon on a pear. Squidward on a chair. It's weird how Eddie's heal is jawbreaker break, but you can't really break a jawbreaker, or at least not with your teeth. The only thing you would really break with a jawbreaker is, well, your jaw. <laughs> Surprisingly high, but clearly not. these do I have to slaughter? Well that's a bit violent. I... I was like nothing. 
And I still don't have the beds! Actually, let me just see one of my friends is online if he wants to stream with me. This whole grinding thing kind of reminds me of that one episode of South Park where the guys are just grinding in World of Warcraft because someone keeps bullying them. So they have to train on level 1 enemies. And it takes them like how many weeks to actually do that. So it's like, Mom, bring my hat back in. It's so relatable though. yellows, eight blues, ten reds. Insane. We need ten more toxic spawn crates, which is also insane, but not that much. Oh, oh, sorry, B. Toxic spawn. By the end of this, we're gonna have about 13,000 taros. So earlier, I mentioned winning an 8700k from a PAX West stream. I really want to go to PAX West because I've heard. Okay, whenever I see a convention stream, I always want to go there. This happens with E3, happens with PAX, happens with BlizzCon, TwitchCon. Just, it's because I go to PAX East. Uh, I've been going to PAX East for the past two years. Well, I went this year and last year, so I guess one year. And I always loved it. There are always a bunch of people just like me. It's just whenever I hear about uh, convention coverage, I always love to watch it. I always wish that it was there. So if I win the lottery, I'm going to every convention ever. I don't care how much school I miss. No, just kidding. No. Stay in school. Go to conventions. If you can get an extension on your work or, you know. If your grades are really low, don't go to a convention. It may seem fun, but passing your classes is way more worth it. Or just go on a weekend. Because I usually go on the Sundays when it's less chaotic. And Saturday is usually one of the busiest days. Stay in drugs, don't do school. No, Ben, shut up. 
Wait, since when have you been a uh, Twitch Turbo member? I don't remember you signing you up for that. That's the stuff. Gotta go. Another gumball, another orange shirt, and another mace. Oh my gosh. Too many of these friggin' things. Need seven. No, eight more. No, you. I don't know why that's there. Prime. Hmm. Okay. Well, I guess Twitch Prime, one of the benefits is less ads or something. No, if I could allow subscribers, I would definitely make you subscribe to me with Twitch Prime. Just know that once I get my affiliate status, I'm going to make you do that, Ben. Twitch occasionally gives you free shit. <laughs> Never given me anything free. I have a Twitch beanie over there, and that wasn't even from Twitch. That was from somebody else who got it from a Twitch booth at a convention, and I bought it off of them on eBay. Yeah, the secret's out. I don't actually have a legitimate Twitch hat. And what do you mean, no thanks? I didn't say I was giving you a choice. You're subscribing to me. Well, you don't have to put my- well, I, yeah, true. Still gotta get my debit card. I don't even have one yet. If I did, I'd probably get Twitch Prime. I'd subscribe to myself. No, you sub to me? I'm broke! You know this, Ben! That's why I was considering selling my 8700k. Excuses, excuses, what? No. Maybe. Maybe. to commit die. Oof. Damn it, I still need seven more. Although I do like the Mach 5 jacket. It's one of my favorite shirts in the game. Running across toxic wasteland. Don't mind me, just running and jumping with a tiny little human thing on my shoulder. Yuck. You know, if you could stop making me dizzy, Mr. Toxic Spawn, that'd just be wonderful. So I got dizzy like three times on that one. Okay, is it just me or do nanos heal faster in this version? They heal pretty friggin' fast. The sad thing is that, like, almost nobody at my school knows that this game exists. Yet. And they certainly don't know about the Revival Project. Like, what's not to love? Look at that. 
thing is adorable. Oh, number two, he's he's so cute. Looks like a sort of shit game. No, no, trust me. I originally thought it was kind of bad. I thought it was kind of weird how all the cartoon number characters were in one spot, but it really grew on me. It's just the graphics, though. Like, you could tell this was made in 2009. And 10 years later, Wizard 101 is just now making their game look nicer. I mean, if you're not into the whole MMO sort of thing, you know, that's cool. I know plenty of people that don't like MMOs. Stop the graphics that make it look like a bad game. Well then what is it? Cause this isn't the whole game. This isn't grinding the game. I'm not sure if uh, that was obvious or not. That enemy wasn't even... Okay, he glitched. And he's dead now, so that's what you get. Do we? Hello there. Shoes. Oh, we already have the shoes. Seriously? You can't just give me the pants? I had one job. Okay, now we need three more crates. I want to fill up my inventory so I can get as much money as possible. Look at this. What kind of game have you played, Ben, that has an edible looking gun? Like, does that not look like the tastiest gun you've ever seen? inventory space. Of course not. We didn't get the pants in any of these crates. Oh, we're running. Run tactics. Who needs parkour when you have the floor? Now you're probably saying, what's the point of parkour if there isn't even if you can just walk on the floor? You know, doesn't that defeat the purpose? And to that I say, I don't know, shut up. I've got lots of stuff for sale. I got lots of stuff for sale. Okay. Time to sell literally everything.
Oh, nearly 17,000 Taros. We came in here with about 10,000. That shows how profitable this is. We made almost 8,000 Taros from just one grinding session. Isn't that just amazing? Hey, where are you going? Okay, uh, let's go to Peach Creek Commons. Let's hang out with the community or something like that. If there's even anyone online, I, I don't even know where the Time Squad is. Time Squad is an event, by the way. Apparently, if you find them, you get some old retro items from when the game was still new. You thought you saw box forts before? Look at that. That's the biggest box fort I have ever seen. He was hanging around. Let's see. Zadwan 2. Surprised nobody in here is named Despacito. That'd be kind of dumb if they were. Nitrous Eidos. I don't know what these names are. Actually, I'm gonna see what weapons they have on sale. Uh, no, not by bag. I don't want that crap. Okay, nothing interesting. Although the airbrush blaster looks awesome. Well, comparatively. Uh, uh, what is there to do around here? Other than grind and look for extremely rare items, there's nothing to do. Oh yeah, this guy. Combining items. This is where I got one thing to look like another. Like, I can combine, uh... This thing, the hollow suit with that, so I can give I can give the uh, hollow suit, which has uh, which has very very low stats. I can give it way better stats than before. That's the cool thing about it. That's how I managed to get this outfit, this level two outfit, to have level four stats. And there's usually more NPCs around here in the past, but that's still not out yet, so we've got pretty much nothing to do in this game. There's awesome hero, superhero of the American people. What missions do I have? Because I heard that there's like a specific number of missions in the game. So 4 plus 5, 9... Plus nine. Thirty-four. Okay, yeah. So I've done every single possible mission in the game. All thirty-four of them. I guess we can see if anyone's going into second All event. Could jump up here. And believe it or not, this was climbable in the original game. I don't know why you'd ever want to climb up here, but you can't. Please, thank you. But for some reason, you can. You can also go up here, and if you wrap around, okay, let's not do that. You wrap around here. And up to here. Then, uh, oh, come on! Not fair. Go all the way back up. Okay. Very careful. The hero is five name hero. Great Wild Talks. It's either that or the hero is great. Five name hero Wild Talks. No idea what that means. Anyone has guesses, let me know. Leave it in the comment section below. Okay, 
that. Beautiful holograms. Although that guy's not a guide, so I'm gonna shoot at him. Okay, I'm bored. Someone say you. What do you mean you? No you. Go candy! Fast feet! Bye bye! Use the time lab. This is how you're supposed to get to the pass, but yeah, the pass is not available in the sneak peek. So, uh, but we want to get onto the roof. We, my friends, or anyone that considers me a very nice person, like an ally almost, ever. What? What is your English, sir? Here. Okay, so apparently this thing is here. Some people might not have heard about being able to climb the treehouse, although a lot of people are doing it now. That's why we're gonna be late to the trend. How do I... I think it was you jump up here, and then you go up the branch, and you're at this thing. Giant box. Who's first? You need, like, speed, nano. Did? You ever did what? I don't know what you're saying. No, this is just a blank box. Uh, how do I get up here? I don't think I'm gonna wanna... I know that with the speed nano, it's so much easier. If I had the, a rocket jump nano, that'd be so much better. Unless if there's like another way... Do you know the way? Go candy! Huzzah! Can't catch me. Jumped. I had to make like Van Halen and jump. Do do do. Ah. Okay. Uh. Ah. Uh. Here. Uh. Nope. Uh. No, this is a possible jump. Whoever here? Did you ever hear the uh. tragedy of Darth Plagueis uh. the Wise? Uh. Tragedy, yep, I knew it. Oh, let me guess, you're gonna twist it at the very end. So it's gonna sound like Tragedy of Dark Plague is the Wise, but it's gonna be something completely different. Got up, number two. Okay. Uh, this branch. Hit detection is really spotty on here. Tragedy of your milkshake. Yes, the tragedy of my milkshake. It brought all the boys to the yard. Uh, these boxes are clearly here for a reason. And that's to completely miss a jump. Not up here. Whoa. Still have a, a way to go, but this is kind of how you do it. This is number four's telescopy box. Uh, what was the area we were trying to get onto? I know this was not it. There was a weird, plain-looking box below us. Imagine having a treehouse like this in real life, like, jeez. Parents didn't even do anything about it in the show. Like, I guess it was kids next door. It was all about kids. But you'd think the adults also next door would see this, you know, general health concern. Especially since they had a moon base. So multiple parents' children were missing because they were on the freaking moon. So, I think we need to try to get on the boat. 
or do we need to get up there? Because I see a ladder up here somewhere. Um, leap of faith. I completely missed. Crap. Jumped up there. <laughs> And yeah, no, no. <laughs> I'm gonna cry like a little baby about this. Now that's a real tragedy, Ben. Take notes. Actually, don't take notes. That's probably a bad idea to take notes on. And you don't do that. Then you land it. And then you land that. And then you go up here and you realize you can't go any further. So you go somewhere else. So I think you go up here. Aha! Uh -huh. I think. The camera is really spotty. Oh, 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 oh! We got something! We can get on the boat somehow. How do I get on the boat? Okay, maybe if we go up here. Here's number two's... I don't even know what this is. It's a, it's a very open-ended box. A really good view of Sector V. You also get a view of the um, infected zone over there. That is... Pokey Oaks Junior High. Uh, there is something up here. But, somewhere in the distance, there is a way to go up further. Um. Go KND! Uh, go KND! Go KND, go KND. I know that we can get up here, but... Boat! That boat is the key to getting to the top of this friggin' treehouse. Back up. There's that branch down there, but you can't jump up to there from here. Uh, how do you get up there? I kinda wanna go up this branch, but this doesn't really... Wait a minute, that might be the branch that I need! Go KND! Fast feet! No! Uh, I made a terrible mistake! Uh, uh, you've gotta be kidding me! I gotta go all the way back up so I can try that stupid jump again. Now you're probably wondering, why not go do something else? There's nothing else to do in this game. It's early access. Up on the lone branch. One branchy boy. Judging with the strange hitboxes on these branches. It's so hard. They're overly polygonal. Again, 2009, but still overly polygonal. Um, do you go up this way? Oh? Oh? Ow! Oh. Ow! Oh. <laughs> I just want to get to the top of the tree! We're gonna try something else. I don't know what to try specifically, 
but we're gonna try something in the future. Heck yeah, in the future. So, we were left over here. That led, okay, so that leads up to the middle of that. We're trying to get on to that. Uh... If I mess up, I'm gonna fall again. I always brag about how they're able to do this, but they... Like... <laughs> okay, at least we landed over here. But how do you even climb up this thing? Oh! 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 Uh, okay, so we either want to get onto the boat or onto that other platform that's nearby. Oh, how to do this, though? The weird clipping in this tree. Ha! <laughs> Look at this! I'm Jesus! I can float in trees! I don't know what that was. Um, this branch in the distance seems convincing. Oh, hello! Hello! Oh, what's this? It's the base of a platform that I can't even get on! What? Oh crap. Is that a... What? Is that not a physical model? Was that just like... Oh my god, what? I gotta go back up there! And again, I would do something else. But the truth is, there's nothing left in this game to do. I've 100%ed two characters out of four that I could make. All that's left is grinding, searching for rare items from Bad Max and Don Doom, and um, going to the Peach Creek uh, Estates Golden Egg, hoping to get a stupid pair of shoes. Try this one. Okay. 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 Not okay. <laughs> that leads us oh. up. I'm trying to get on the boat. Although, who's to say that I'll actually be able to get on the boat at all? What if that boat. I can't physically go on it? No, 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 no. <laughs> Okay, this is not working out, so, um, let's see, what other games do I actually have on this laptop? Because I don't have every single game on here, every game that I own, I have a few, but I have PC Building Simulator, I have Overwatch, I could play on my Minecraft server, not mine, it's Ben's, but it's shared, uh, I could play some Gmod. I don't know what you guys want me to play. Probably open up my Steam so I can look at other games. Or I can work on making my own game. Actually, no. I'm not going to broadcast that. I do, I do want to make my own game, though. I think that'd be fun. Load my 
my steam. You guys can get a nice view of the grass. The very pixelated, barely textured grass. My library. Oh, I still need to merge libraries with Ben. We gotta do that at some point. Um, I already played through Portal. Um, Company of Heroes 2. XCOM Enemy Unknown. Final Fantasy 7, I haven't even touched yet. Guns of Icarus, that's fun. Uh, Civilization 5. Sonic. I have Undertale, but I'm not playing it. I despise that game, so don't ever suggest it. Just thought I'd make that clear. I do have Fallout New Vegas. Forgot about that one. So, uh, if there's a game you want to see, out of the ones that I listed, let me know. Thinking maybe Overwatch, but I'm just really bad at it. And then Gmod, that could be fun. I could play these games, or I could keep trying to climb the KND treehouse. Whatever works with you guys. That's what I want the community to have a presence on my streams. I want it to just be you watch. I want to play games that you would be into. Download a Minecraft mod pack from the Twitch launcher. What Twitch launcher? Hasta luego. There are some good ones that guide you. But what Twitch launcher? Cause I know you sent me a link to Feed the Beast Continuum. I'm not sure what a Twitch launcher is. Look it up. I really should have the chat on screen so that people know what I'm talking about. But I won't. <laughs> Unless if you guys want. Is A1 disabled? I don't know what A1 is. Oh, A1 was my echo. Never mind. <laughs> What's B2 supposed to be? I'll leave it alone. How to play Minecraft with Twitch app. What? That's a thing? Okay, so the Twitch app allows you to install and play and save your Minecraft worlds. You can install manage mods, mod packs, maps, and resource packs for those worlds. In a very easy use easy to use user interface. I have Java, I have the game. Number two, catch you later.
Wait, gotta download the Twitch app. Alright, so I'll download that right now. Uh, is there anything you guys want me to play in the meantime? While I get this set up. Minesweeper? I don't even have Minesweeper. Windows laptops just don't come with Minesweeper anymore, I don't think. Three stars? That what? Okay, Twitch app should be installed. I don't know what it's doing now. Mods. Minecraft. Well, apparently I need to install something. I don't know what it is. Okay, so I'm gonna put the Twitch app here. No, Ben, I'm not playing Minesweeper. <laughs> for you? Crap. It's just a black screen. Damn it! <laughs> Hold up. No, that's not what I meant. Uh... Damn, well, I accidentally closed Fusion Fall Retro. <laughs> okay, let's get this up and running. Not showing up. Okay, for some reason that's not showing up. So I'll have to just. I uh, I don't even know what I'm gonna have to do. Uh, what's a Minecraft mod pack that you guys want me to play? Hopefully I can get some friends online so that they can play it with me. Why is this not loading for me? Go for one with quests so it'll guide you a bit. Okay then. 
Um, quests. Quest category. Sev Tech Ages. So it's packed with content and progression. This pack focuses on providing the player a long term progression experience with purpose. Involves mechanics. Hiding or until unlocked. Dynamically hidden items and recipes based on progress. New mobs appear as you progress further and all that. So it uses the vanilla advancement system to guide the player while allowing an open sandbox experience. Okay. That sounds fun. You'll start your first world with nothing. No map or HWYLA. Only a handful of items and recipes. Unlock those features, thousands of blocks and items, and much more. You must follow through the advancement system from the Stone Age all the way into space. Well, let's install, shall we? Are downloading this. change my stream game oh wow there's a lot of mods 243 it's like it's almost how many my um my what what is it uh g mod that's almost how many g mod mods i have Jeez, that's nuts uh we're gonna go in It should be updated. Here. Oh my god, so many of these. We're only up to 140, I have 243. I'm only gonna be able to play for another half hour, actually, so. really much to do while I wait. I would play music, but uh, copyright gets in the way. Last time I did that, it, uh, my audio got muted. Done. Alright. And it's downloading more stuff. It's downloading runtime. Then I got runtime. Now if you could actually run on time, that'd be great. I have six Twitch notifications. in login stuff which you can't see so haha -ha. well it's not even loading so <laughs> that's a haha -ha to me I could just you know put it put 
obtain my information so I can, you know, play the game. That'd be cool. There we go. Alright, downloading this and oh. Sorry about the wait, you guys. I promise next stream will not have this much waiting on downloads. Now I like how the top games, Fortnite still hasn't gone above CSGO. Fortnite has 185,000 viewers, CSGO has 340,000. I mean, granted, with Fortnite, Ninja has like, Ninja makes up like half those viewers. Which is insane for any streamer. Gonna add the game window source. If it would be so kind as to actually work. Okay, it's not showing up for some reason. I don't know why that is. I barely dropped any frames. So initialize all these mods. Okay, so we might not actually get to playing it today. This sucks. I really wanted to try this. To still try to get Minecraft on the on OBS for some reason it's not cooperating with me. There we go. This display capture maybe. No, I managed to get it with window capture somehow. There we go. Perfect. Woo! It's all blue and stuff. Got that little guy dancing down there. I don't know why that is. 
just hopped up on coffee or something. This is EvTech. Yes, yes it is. Decided to stop after phase one or something. Okay. Oh, now it's telling me something. There we go. Now we're loading all this stuff. God, that's a lot of items. And I gotta open up Gmod so I can get all those mods installed so I'll be ready to play Gmod whenever I whenever I want. And I'll also be ready for streaming. Gotta work on how to make a local game though or like multiplayer server for my friends. Team friends. Why was it taking long to load stain class? I just realized I have to go to Boy Scouts tonight. And I guess I'm gonna have to cut the stream short after all this loads. I am contributing to my Boy Scout troop. I also need to... I would stream while people are home, but... They like to tease me about all this crap. They always like to interrupt my streams. So that's why I decide against streaming while parents are home. Although if if it's only my sister, then that's fine. She understands it. That's the reason why I only stream on Wednesdays. Or if I'm on like a break, my parents still have to go to work, but I'm on school break. Then that happens. I am regretting this. I really should have done this before I streamed. I always have stuff prepared, but I don't know, I guess some for some reason I neglected to do that. By the way, uh meant to ask, is my audio good at all? If it's too loud, too quiet, please let me know. I've been trying to constantly improve the stream quality. Now that I'm on a better laptop, I have a lot more freedom.
is, is using a lot of memory. Two whole gigs of RAM. Okay, now we're just getting into phase two of initialization. Wonderful. Oh, you didn't allocate more? I don't know how to allocate more. Kind of just play it how it is. I don't even know how to optimize my cores. Usually I leave that stuff alone because I don't want to mess anything up. Although I should probably use a bit more RAM because I got 8 whole gigabytes. I don't see if another gigabyte could 512 megs. Oh, they hear one of the buses. Modular machinery. Huh. Although, once I build that, like, high-end desktop, that's gonna be my gaming thing. This laptop will just be for making an output. This is just gonna be my alternate screen, and I'll have that old monitor as, like, a tertiary screen. I think that I'm gonna have, like, my laptop here, desktop over here, and I'm gonna have a desktop monitor sitting next to my laptop screen, and now I'm going to have my other monitor, my old monitor, just sitting above. Or maybe I'll have all three of them. I haven't decided yet. I should play PC Building Simulator so I could actually, like, show off what I'm looking at possibly getting. Tinker's Construct. Okay, I, I've at least heard of that one. Voice cracks. I've at least I've at least heard of that one. Immersive engineering. Mechanism. Better with mods. Applied energistics. I know that one. Build craft sounds familiar. PC builders. Hold up. Journey map. Galactic Craft. Okay, I love Galactic Craft. I thought one of the, I thought one of the mods was called Autistic. Ugh, that would have been something. I guess to uh, those people watching, what mod packs do you guys like to play? I'm just curious. Give me some ideas.
just enough items. I, I've heard of too many items, but just enough. That's kind of funny. Let's see, what are we looking at now? Okay, so they're downloading more plugins for just enough items, apparently. Wow, that is a lot of ingredients. Jeez. Well, I'm glad that I'm downloading all of these things, because I always want more variety in my Minecraft. A few years ago, it was all just creative mode, build whatever the hell you want. You know, totem whittling knife? Uh, it's kind of weird. You know, one day when I have enough money to do so, I kind of want to make, like, a Minecraft server for all my followers. Or maybe just make a subscriber-exclusive Minecraft server. That'd be cool. Because I know some people that do that. Like, I lo I, I'd probably do something for my followers, it's just, you know. Oh, wait, I don't know. Okay, here we go. I'll shut up now. Uh, okay. This is, uh, this is quite a screen, wouldn't you say? So, let's look at our, our options. Okay, okay. Now we just want graphics fast! Nah, just kidding, we want it fancy. Oh, I don't really care about clouds, brightness, bright, desync, blah, 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 blah. I heard full screen is a good idea. Wait, does it come with the resource back? Oh, it does not. So, not sure if I'm going to do multiplayer with somebody else. Or if I'm just gonna do single player, I guess I'll give it a shot. So we're just gonna go into creative mode just so I could show you. Well, not so I can show you, so I can see everything that's in it. But next stream, I'll be making a survival world. So I will be playing in survival. OBS. No, 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 it's not. Y'all ain't supposed to see that. Is that better? I know it's not a creative friendly pack. It's just I want to see everything that's everything I'm going to be working with. I'm going to call this one Eat. I just want to see what's in it. If you die, Death Compass will spawn in your inventory. This will point you to the direction of your grave. Oh, that's dark. We're going to show you where you died. I swear, once I get that desktop computer, this is going to load a lot faster. I'll probably just, like, take the drive out of this, 
or put it onto external and transfer it to my desktop so I don't have to do all this installation again. Holding the drawer key in your offhand will lock a newly placed storage drawer. Okay. Okay, so the screen is turning kind of white in a not responding message, so that must be good, right? No, maybe. Maybe. Is it gonna work? Eh? Huh? Eh? Huh? Is it gonna work? Eh? Huh? Huzzah! It froze. <laughs> It not it gave me a not responding twice. Okay. Welcome to Sevtech. Open the advancements window to find out how to progress. Default keys low. Wayla and the map are not available from the beginning of the mod pack. They need to be unlocked. There are many blocks that are hidden until unlocked through progression. Be aware, if you change a resource pack while the pack is running, you will need to fully restart the game. Do it an issue with items not hiding correctly and recipes not showing. Sorry for the inconvenience. For multiplayer information, multiplayer team information, use the mod together forever and check the commands. Being with slash tuff using in game chat. This information in Hinge Locks can be accessed again by pausing the game and opening the what's new icon on the right side of the screen. Boom! Increase your dedicated, <laughs> your dedicated wham. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Four build craft books you find here. And if you have. Try disabling everything in the build graph performance config section. Uh, how? Oh, this is laggy on startup. What the? Ow. Oh, fancy. Okay, so what we're gonna do. You're gonna make sure the graphics are fast. That's that's the important thing. And maybe lower the render distance a little bit. That's better, right? No? Okay. Oh, okay, what is this? Friendly a garden. What is this thing? Cinnabar sample. Stage three first. Creative plus. This is creative plus apparently. Learn all this in tutorial apparently. Carbon values. All these items will make sense in survival by the way. I know, I just want to see what's in here. Gonna take a look around. Olive wood. Uh, crap. I didn't mean to do that. Wait, where'd it go? Where's my, uh. Where's my. Where's the delete block from inventory button? Wait a minute, how did that thing drop again? Okay, that looks cool. Oh, that's so weird. It drops on the side. Okay, that's interesting. But how do I, like, get rid of it? Drops. Ooh, what's that? Rice. Okay, so we can be Japanese now. Well, oh, the ground's on fire. Okay, I fixed it. So, lots of foliage. We got... Needs stage zero. Oh, gee, thanks. So, orange gladiola. Gladiola, I hardly knew her. Some dirt blocks. Terra clay. Wet mud. 
What is this thing? A black lotus. Oh, that looks cool. Oh, well, this is uh, adventurous. By the way, Twitch logo on my skin. Gnarly, I know. That's the closest I can make to my own self in game. <laughs> okay, anyway. I can't wait to play this next time. So, um, there isn't really much to say except for subscribe to me on YouTube for archives of the streams and some own um, creative content that is in the works coming soon. And drop a follow on my Twitch. And make sure notifications are on for YouTube and Twitch so you know when I'm live or when I upload a video. That's important if you want to keep up with me. And, yeah, that's all I really got to say. Oh, yeah, check the affiliate links. These guys are awesome. No, wait, those guys are awesome. -er. But all these guys are awesome. You can find affiliate links in my Twitch channel description. And if you're on YouTube, click the Twitch link. I'm not going to put it in the description. <laughs> anyway, catch you all later.